Hello everyone, this is Chris from Nokia Innovation. Uh, just yesterday, on Wednesday the 20th of November, we finally had Instagram, albeit in beta, land on Windows Phone 8. So today, I'm going to take a look at that and a quick comparison with 6Tag, which has been out for some time, arguably one of the best third-party Instagram clients, certainly available on Windows Phone. Uh, is it fair to compare a pretty well-established and updated third-party app against a beta? Probably not, but we're just going to have a quick look. One thing you notice, if you want to pin it to your live tile, is six tag gives you three different tile sizes. Instagram beta, just the one. I've not um, hooked either of them up to give me background updates just yet because of battery issues. I'm not a huge Instagram user. But anyway, let's just have a look. Uh, this on the Nokia Lumia 625 is six tag. This on the Nokia Lumia 920 is Instagram beta. Firstly, if we take a look, Um, both of them work as perhaps you might expect. Uh, six tag gives you a little more real estate. Uh, neither of them work in portrait. If you want to comment on a picture, let's say six tag on our right gives you three buttons at the bottom. It used to have an option where you could manually slide it, but that's been taken out. You can now do it like that by pressing the button, so we'll like it. It looks like you can download it to your phone. I guess that's re-share it, and that one is to put a comment on it. Uh, one biggie, I suppose you could say, which you just witnessed, adverts come up on six tag, not so on Instagram, which is fair enough. I mean, six tag is a free download. They're both free downloads. And uh, the developer has to fund himself somehow. And he's doing a very good job. So I certainly don't begrudge the odd advert across the top. And you can, I believe, pay to purchase the whole thing. The Instagram beta, you've got two boxes here. You can comment on it or you can like it. By hitting that, I have already liked it, so hopefully I haven't just unliked it. Um, there was a little confusion apparently on the Instagram client that you couldn't actually take a picture from inside the app. While that's not strictly true, we'll just take a quick look at that. If you press the button there, it gives you your, uh, you can select which album you want to take from, or you can take a picture from the camera itself. And that then takes you into your camera application. You can accept, now, one thing you have to bear in mind is while you may take a full screen picture, what then appears here is anything but full screen. You then get the few boxes. We'll accept that anyway. We'll put, I mean, we all know what these are like. We'll leave it there and we'll now take a look at six tag and see how they do things. That's the picture button. You've got the option here. You can go to your albums. Or you can take a picture yourself. Now here at least they give you the box around. So you know just how big your picture is going to be. You can put the grid in if you wish. As in terms of lenses, I don't know 
how they work. They look like they both have the same one. Normal Amaro Mayfair Rise. Normal Amaro Mayfair and Rise. So, yeah. Kelvin's at the end, 77. Yeah. If you then want to proceed, you press the arrow at the top. And it then gives you the option with this one. You've got a little tick box at the bottom. And again, you can select which social network sites you want to share with. You can say whether you want location on, whether you want to add it to the map. Uh, you can choose location on both. And they both come up with more or less the same information, which is quite cool. I'm not actually going to... Well, yeah, why not? I'm just going to share it like that. Okay, and that is uploading. Uh, at the top here, you can go to search users and hashtag. On the six tag, you've got a search one there. But then you've also got that down here. So I don't know. Search hashtags. Go back to home, press the back button. You've got the refresh button. Activity. That's my activity, what I've been doing. Uh, interesting thing with six tag, you can change what you do. Uh, you can change the set up. Uh, you can have a light theme or a dark theme. I'm going to go dark. Um, you can have the Polaroid or the modern. I'm going to go modern. I did. So we'll go back. There you go. Is that a bit more what we're used to? Okay, well, that's a very quick look at the two Instagram clients for Windows Phone. Well, not the only two. There's plenty more. But two of the maybe better, well, more well-known ones. Not to take anything away from the other third-party clients, which all do a very good job. Yeah. That is six tag and Instagram beta. Uh, let us know what you think. This is Chris for Nokia Innovation. Be interested to read your comments or any questions you might have. Thanks for watching.